Hello everyone, my name is Paul, this is my niece Gadi, and uh, we're just starting out to make YouTube videos, and what we wanted to do was to read to you guys something like a story time, uh, the story of Easter. My niece Gadi will be reading it, and also after, we're going to say a prayer for all of the children, plus the children of Ukraine, because there's a lot going on in the world today. And uh, we are Chris Christian, and we believe in Jesus Christ uh, as our Lord and as our sa Savior. So we would like just, it was on our hearts to come up with, with this. So please, everyone, have a bit of patience. Uh, it's our first time doing this. Gabby, go right ahead. Okay. <clears throat> 2,000 years ago, a man called Jesus brought a message of hope and love to the world. He visited Jerusalem and people celebrated waving palm branches in the air, but some people wanted to get rid of him. On the Thursday, Jesus washed the feet of his friends. He did this to teach them that they should serve and help others. Jesus then had a last supper with his friends. He shared a cup of wine and a piece of bread, telling his friends, Do this in remembrance of me. Amen. During the supper, a man called Judas slipped out. He was going to betray Jesus. Later that night, Judas brought the soldiers and led them to Jesus. Jesus was praying, but he was arrested and led away. On the Friday, a man called Pilate put Jesus on trial and handed Jesus over to be killed and then washed his hands. The soldiers then put a purple robe purple robe on Jesus and a crown of sharp thorns and led him away. Jesus then had to carry his cross throughout the streets of Jerusalem. The soldiers then put Jesus on a cross between two thieves. When Jesus died, there was an earthquake and darkness fell. After he died, they placed Jesus' body in a tomb and rolled a large stone over the entrance. Mary, the mother of Jesus, was sad. <clears throat> Early on Sunday, the women went to the tomb and found the stone rolled away from the tomb entrance. Suddenly, two men in bright, shining clothes stood by them. They asked, Why are you looking among the dead? For one who was alive, he's not mm -hmm. here. He's been raised. Glory to God. Happy Easter. His friends then met Jesus, who had risen from the dead. They were filled with joy and later traveled the world telling people about Jesus. The events which we celebrated at Easter took place about 2,000 years ago. The friends of Jesus still follow him today and know his love in their lives today. Billions of people all over the world believe that by dying and coming back to life, Jesus as the Son of God gives people the chance to know God in a new way. Amen. And with that, if anyone has any comments or anything, please feel free to leave comments or how you think we could improve what we're trying to do here today. Uh, we would just now like to pray for all the child children going through everything you see on everyday news with all the things happening in the world so we would like for you if you would like to pray with with us gabby lead us into prayer darling dear jesus i come before you today and i pray i pray for all these kids here who are sick I pray for them to be healed, Jesus, and for you to wipe away their sickness, Jesus, because they're just kids, and for all these Ukrainian babies, Jesus, for them to be safe and for the war to stop because they're kids and it's awful for them to be in that country, Jesus. 
with all that going on. And I pray that you keep every kid in the world safe because they're Amen. all your angels, Amen. Jesus, Hallelujah. from heaven. And I pray Amen. that they have a good life growing up. Amen. Amen. Thank you, everybody who sees this video. And please feel free to give us a, a like. Thanks. See you next time.